Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel Camzin. In this video, we are going to go over the Perkin reaction. This reaction developed by Perkin and is used to make cinnamic acid by aldol condensation of aldehyde and acid anhydride in the presence of alkali salt of an acid. Aromatic aldehyde which is benzaldehyde is treated with anhydride which is acetic anhydride in the presence of its salt which is potassium or sodium salt in this reaction the sodium acetate is used to produce a compound which is alpha beta unsaturated acid so this product is cinnamic acid let us see the mechanism for this perkin reaction the alkali salt of an acid break down to form acetate ion which is acid ion and sodium ion this acetate ion attacks the acetic anhydride to abstract the proton from acetic anhydride to produce acetic acid and carbon ion so this carbon ion act as a nucleophile this carbon ion attacks the carbonyl carbon of benzaldehyde because the oxygen in the carbonyl carbon is more electronegative than this carbon so nucleophile attacks the carbonyl carbon of benzaldehyde and produce alk oxide ion this alk oxide ion abstract the proton from acetic acid and produce beta hydroxy anhydride why it is called beta hydroxy anhydride because beta on beta carbon hydroxide group is present so this beta hydroxyl anhydride undergoes dehydration then alpha carbon gives hydrogen atom and beta carbon gives hydroxyl group to produce water so a dehydrated compound is produced this dehydrated compound undergo hydrolysis and produce cinnamic acid this cinnamic acid is our end product and the by product is acetic acid so the net result is that cinnamic acid can be produced by the reaction of aldehyde and acetic anhydride in the presence of the sodium acetate or potassium acetate so thanks for watching